Welcome back to Far Cry 3, everyone. Hope you're all enjoying the series so far. I'm loving recording it. This is probably my favourite series I've ever recorded. I'm having the time of my life. I'm on my third episode of the day right now, recording in a row. It's ridiculous. Uh, so last episode, we spent... I spent, like, 20 minutes looking for boar so I could get a ammo pouch, and I failed. So we're going to have to stick with the ammo we have and look for any other ammo. Right now, we're talking to Buck. Your buck. Well, it's not my birthday. She must be Christmas. <laughs> I'm here for my friend, Keith. Nah, I'm sorry, it doesn't ring a bell. You bought him from Hoyt. Ah, him. <laughs> he said his name was... <laughs> You're hysterical. <laughs> All right, then. Let's get down to brass tags. You must be Jason Brody. Look, I just want Keith. Jason, Jason, Jason. God, we're not all savages here. We're just businessmen, responsible capitalists. I've got something that, that you want, right? That's a product. You've got something that I want. And what the hell is that? Temper, temper, Jace. Be careful. If you do me in, you'll never get him back. Find this for me. You score that, and you and I are even, Stephen. And Keith goes with you. Bring me what has been lost. I've, I've seen this knife before. A knife? What do you mean a knife? It's not just a fucking knife. It's art. All history in this and you and Keith's four eyes squeezed together. That's my fucking fee, right? Where is it? It's fridge under. He knew where it was. He got the wanker's boat, research he was doing on some Chinese treasure, and his crew. Do you know what else he got? A knife? No, not a knife. It's location. Mm hmm. <laughs> you want Keith back? Get on the goddamn boat. Find out where the artifact's buried before someone else nicks it. I'm on your bike. Pipe off. Escalator quickly. So this is cool, we've got two conflicting characters who both want the knife. And right now we're infiltrating the nostalgia? Okay, um, this might be cutscene worthy to be fair. It's 800 meters. I'm learning a lot more about distance and what it's worth in terms of scale and Far Cry. 700 meters if we get a car, we could probably have a pretty good conversation. But uh, yeah, my loot rock sucks full. Do I have any more skill points, by the way? No. Okay, my loot rocks are full. Uh, many from all the leaves. So, a good way to get rid of them is literally to use them up. Get medicine. You need one. Oh, it's because my syringe kit's full. I see. So, that's an, as many syringe kits as you can get. I don't have a wallet, apparently. I'm guessing that'll allow us to get more money. Uh, special arrows, <laughs> fire arrow, I guess. Although I don't have a bow. All right, well, that was kind of pointless. Probably just using more of our loot rock sack by uh, by crafting those things. Okay, so looks like there's a car down here, but I don't. Know if yeah, we'll be able to have this. So let's get talking. Um. Honestly, rating, this is such an amazing game. I absolutely love it. Like, the storyline's great. I don't play many games. I don't play many expensive games. But, um, for me, this is, like, really good. Like, I'm really, I'm really enjoying myself. Um, I definitely, like, recommend it. Because games are so awkward. Like, films and games are so awkward. People say they'd recommend it. But that's, like, a lot of the time it's for people with a specific taste. Like, I like Star Wars, but a lot of people say, oh, it's the best series ever. I love it so much. But that's because Star Wars is what they're into. They're into, like, um, like sci-fi. Whereas I think this is quite general. Um, you can quite easily get into this because it's just like an open world uh, sort of action-adventure game. 
So I do believe. Oh god, what have I done? Right. Well, I yeah, but I do think that a lot of people. Um, this would fit a lot of people because it's just so like general. Um, it's open world. It's so much fun. It's an action storyline. It's not very specific. Whereas you know, someone like CS:GO, for example, it's a very specific FPS set game. You have to be good at FPSs. You have to be competitive. All this stuff. Far Cry 3 is chill, and it's five quid on Steam if you find it on sale. Sale if you catch it on a sale. Um, I would do my usual sponsorship of CD keys. In fact, I don't think that's been mentioned on this channel at all. But um, yeah, I talk a lot about CD keys. CDKeys.com because I mean you get CD keys for Steam and it's quite cheap. But they don't actually do Far Cry 3. They don't do all games. They do a lot of games like Call of Duty World War 2. Although that is still quite a high price. Where the hell is this? What the? It's in the middle of the water. Is it that boat? Alright. Whatever. We're going to have to infiltrate the nostalgia. <laughs> is that the name of the boat? I prefer if we could get like a jet ski or something. As opposed to having to swim out there. Sweet. Get speedo. Let's head out. There's another one there. I didn't re realise. Um, by the way, when I said speedo, I meant speedofar. I was trying to make that reference to uh, GTA 5, but kind of messed it up. And just said speedo, which is a normal term. Why is this hanging? Oh, it's on crane. I was about to say, like, um, the texture's not loaded in, and I've... Oh, okay, I've alerted everyone already. Yeah, I do need ammo for this mission, then. Well, this is going to be risky. Yeah, no. It'd be better if we just, like, hadn't alerted them at all. Because now we're pretty messed up. We can't really do much. They're literally right up there. I can't get my gun out. <laughs> you say he lost me. Should I rush them? I've got grenades. Could I throw a grenade from the water? Wait, if I jump on this... Oh, that's a shot. Okay. Let's get out of here. Apparently they see me. Oh, they see me? Really? Right, let's get to a point where they're going to struggle to see me. Right, so we can't sort of mess around in the water for too long. Because the shark's going to eat us. Um, I'm not too sure, not too sure how to approach this situation, honestly. Um, I'm, let's see if there's any way to go around the back. Oh, they got snipers. Okay. Fair enough. Go around this way. Alright, looks like we're just going to have to rush on board. And this is... I was completely wrong. This is definitely a mission where you need ammo. And plenty of it. But we're going to risk it. We've got more hearts. Uh, we're just going to go right in for it. Let's go. I'm going to want to take that guy down soon. Oh! This is so bad, man. This is just... No. It's not going to work. Um, ammo wasn't really something I was worried about. Maybe not getting spotted while approaching it might be a good idea. Um, because ammo is not... I wasn't worried about running out of ammo just then. Uh, that wasn't really a problem at all we've we been spotted no it got like halfway through the bar and i was like okay it's fine they didn't fully see me they just saw me a little bit all right let's get to a good spot which is going to be nowhere i don't think there's any snipers over here i've got one here what is this i was can you hear me spamming e are you dumb? This game is so messed up. What's wrong with this game? Same thing again, we're just gonna have to keep rushing them. There's nothing you can upgrade unless you want to just upgrade your health tons before doing this. 
which isn't really a possibility so all right let's not get there because of the sniper but then we don't want to go down the other side either because there's going to be tons of people so either way can you stop oh my god this game is so dumb this is so annoying i hate this it's just too many people to kill it's really straightforward it's just too many people to kill we just gotta watch where they're gonna come from where are we getting shot at from this game do you want to stop Let's hold this position. For God's sake. It's just annoying. If we can take out that guy. And this sniper as well. That's going to help us out quite a bit. But not enough. Right, up we go. Oh, there's one. No, he's dead. Alright, let's push forward. Okay, there's quite a lot of people spawning in now, so it's getting quite a bit more serious. Oh, they might be down below, actually. I was a bit confused as to where people were. Are they all down here? I can't tell. Oh. There's one. Yeah. Oh, my God, we're already out of ammo. This is r pretty ridiculous. If we grab this gun, this might have ammo. Oh, it's a sniper. And it has five ammo. Yeah, about that. Okay. Let's do this. Ooh. Maybe. Find the entrance. Okay. Give me some time. How is he not dead after that shot? Like, this is a pretty OP sniper and he just didn't die. Just like, yeah. Pretty, pretty realistic. And then we've got one over here. Three ammo. I understand. Maybe it's because it's like trying to go through this metal bit. Reload. Reload, I said. Okay, this mission is actually stressing me out. You can probably tell. It's really annoying. It's really difficult. Oh, yeah, he's just not dead, is he? No, of course he isn't. Two grenades. Yeah, that's all I've got, mate. Sorry, did you want a bit more? Molotov as well. Would that make... Oh, dear. I messed that up. Alright, um... What have we got? I've got ammo for this. Alright, this guy is just annoying me at this point. Entrance is over here. Got one skill point. After all my efforts, I got one skill point. Sick. Alright, I don't think there's anyone else to worry about at the moment, so I'm just going to loot bodies. And get guns. Grenade. Okay. Money is helpful for ammo. I never really thought much of money, but I'm starting to realise. Uh, can we swap this gun? Oh, I can't pick it up. It's flashing, but I can't. If I switch to my secondary. Oh, I've got ammo for this now, anyway. I've got a little bit, anyway. It'll do us for now. Alright, this is the entrance, anyway. Look at this one as well. Some grenades down there. Cocaine packet. What did I expect? Sorry about my rage earlier and the fact that I was dying because of how badly I was doing. Um, that's not too good. Oh, this is good. I can just wait for them to come in, can't I? If they do come through. I'm hoping they just come through and I can just find the laptop and hold of the nostalgia. Sure. Yeah, sure. Where's this guy? I'm so confused. On the minimap, he should be right here. Unless he's just through this door. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. This is getting ridiculous. It's getting out of hand. Let's just throw a grenade in there. Just for the fun. I don't think it's really doing much, but... Where are they? Wait, are they, are they above or something? Because on the minimap it says they're here, but they're not. Oh, they're below. You can go down. That's pretty cool. Are they? God knows. Right, let's get through here. Okay. 
God, he got close. What does this sound thing mean? Oh, they want me to do something with that? Disable the alarms! God's sake. I don't not think of that. Uh, where's the second one? Is it... What? Where's the second one? Oh, right, well, it wants us to go over there. Maybe it's downstairs, actually. Um, through here. Loot everything where I can. Dog tags. It's pretty interesting. Oh, there's someone else. Oh, he's coming through right now. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. Did you see that, guys? Oh, my God. My, it went on to start menu thing, but that doesn't freeze the game. It just sort of minimizes it, kind of, in a way. So, come on, mate. Oh, God, there's no time limit, because I'm being patient. Let's put it, let's put it like that. That is disturbing in there. What's going on in there? This guy's coming through, I think. No, he's just taking position. God, this ammo is not looking good. I need an ammo pouch. Oh, I see him. That's say, where the hell? Push forwards. Is the laptop just here? Oh, behind me. These guys just run at you with a knife. It's pretty funny. Yo, this guy's OP. Whoa! What's going on with this guy? Oh, he knocked me down. No, 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 no. Right, I've got to wait for him to come through and shoot him. This guy's OP. What's going on with this guy? He's massive. Okay, I'll give up. He's dead. I guess that works. Killed myself as well, but he's dead, so... <laughs> Completely out of ammo. Let's look for more guns and hope that no one's going to come towards us. Go to the AK. Oh, we've got a little bit more. I think when you just sort of walk over them, you get a bit more ammo for it. Alright, whatever. That'll do the job for now. This, look how massive this guy is. Okay, uh, what are we doing? Laptop, of course. Not going to have to do hacking, are we? He's going to do it himself. Please. I don't know this cutscene, so... Thank God for the checkpoint. Don't know what's going on now, though. Some of it's here. Sure. This is sweet, man. What is that? It's the Molotov or something. Oh. That's helpful. Okay. I get it now. This is so cool. Like, the, the thingies all tilted and everything. It's mad. That cutscene was literally just him shutting the hot, shutting the door. Backtrack to escape the boat. Escape. Oh, through here. I was about to say, what the hell? How? These ridiculous cutscenes. It's fair enough. I mean, it's pretty hard door to open, I guess. What's going on? Oh, down here. That's a good point. Quick, quick, quick. Oh, see, hate this sort of thing. It's the first one of the game, though. I mean, sometimes there's space to mash. Uh, but yeah, that's the first actual one of them. We have to do a few. Where's this? Grab that. I don't know how to see your uh, oxygen level like underwater. Never got my head around that really. Wow, it's just setting me new locations to go to. I'm like, yeah, I'm there. And it just sets me another one. It's pretty annoying. It's cool, though. Does it in stages. It's fair enough. 
That's it. Smash that open. And get out of there. Get out! Okay. Alright, loading. It's all gone white now. And cutscene. Rise and shine. Come on. No, the woods are lovely, dark and deep, eh? Hey, get the fuck up! Come on! Here you go. You found my prize yet? It wasn't on the boat. Oh, Jason. Keith is going to be very disappointed. He looked uncomfortable last I saw him. Why are you telling me this? Entertainment, my dear. Entertainment. <laughs> Did you happen to find a compass? Excellent. Very good. Now, research says, follow the compass. Thanks for your help. Anytime. Now, if you can handle being on your own, some. Keith needs me. All right? Toodles. Nice. I think that concludes a very long episode. Um, I've actually got quite a long time to spare. I've sort of almost formed a routine of recording these videos. Like, when I get home from school, I'll spend a few hours playing online with Jamie and that on my other games. And then later into the evening, I'll spend a few hours recording these. And, uh, yeah, I've got quite a lot of time to spare. So I think I'll do some off-camera stuff. <coughs> I need to activate the radio tower in this area. Which shouldn't be too far away, to be honest. It's only there. 400 meters uh, stuff like that I'm gonna get that done and I'm gonna see you guys in the next video